guys, my name is Brittany Lozano. I'm the director of My Life, My Power. My name is Daniel Pewter. I'm the founder of My Life, My Power, and I'm an undefeated mixed martial arts fighter. Now, we've got a video to share with you guys today from Eric McCormick. Daniel, tell us a little bit about him. You know, he's a writer, he's a producer, he's a director, he's a singer. He was on the Will and Grace show, and, you know, it's a pretty he funny show. He on NBC. He played yep. the lawyer, right? Yep. And he actually also produced his own um, production company called Big Cattle Productions yeah. to develop ideas for television and media. So he is, he's done a lot of stuff. I'm sure you guys are going to recognize him. And enjoy this video. Have a great day. Thank you. Yeah, I was, uh, I was called fag pretty early on, probably first, second grade before I knew what it was. Uh, second grade, there was a guy way older than me, um, six years older than me, who uh, beat me up on a couple of occasions. And uh, this one time, my father was a typical father back then, always at work, didn't really know much about my school life, but this one particular day he was home for a parent-teacher conference, and I happened to be punched in the stomach on the way home from lunch. and. Uh, and luckily he was there and stepped up and actually went out to the guy's dad and said, have you ever touched my son again? Which was a big moment for me because I didn't feel alone. I didn't feel that I had no, no protection. Um, another big one for me, uh, sixth grade. I had uh, my best friend Bill and I had been misunderstood for many years because, of course, when two guys are that close and play a lot of games, they must be gay. So one day coming out of school, somebody, a guy grabbed Bill and uh, took me years to admit this, but a girl grabbed me and they held us and uh, Dave, the class clown, uh, married us in front of uh, the whole sixth grade. Um, it's all about power. They are not as tough as they look. They may not be tough at all. They need power. They gain power over you, mostly here. I found it, there was occasionally physical stuff, but it wasn't the physical stuff that really stuck. It was, it was how they take your power away. And sometimes they don't even take it. You give it. You simply, you give them the power by letting it get to you, by letting their opinion matter. Um, and, I mean, they've been making high school movies about this topic forever. It comes in different forms, but it always comes down to the same thing. For someone to feel important, they have to, they have to put you down. And you simply can't let it, you simply can't let them and their opinion have any domain over self-esteem. My, my son is eight, and it's the prime time for them to when kids are a little younger, they naturally tattle. They naturally come and tell you what, uh, who did what and who said what. And, and that starts to change around this age. It's harder to get that information out of them. They, they, wanna, they don't want to be a tattletale. They don't want to fit, they want to fit in and they don't, and they very often, like any kind of uh, uh, abuse situation, the ones that are the most abusive are the ones that everyone's, uh, they, everyone wants their approval. So you're not going to snitch. You're going to um, you're going to put up with it. And uh, with my son, we're con and as I think everyone, every parent I know is constantly trying to in trying to encourage them to to speak up. It's not snitching. It is it is protecting yourself and very mu very possibly protecting someone else around you. My son is one of those kids that I I don't I hope he's not. I don't think he's a bully. I don't think he's really being bullied. But he might be one of those kids right in the middle that sees somebody else doing it uh, and it uh, we try to remind him that it's his job he's part of it he's an accomplice if he doesn't if he doesn't speak up and help somebody visit mylifemypower.org and help us take a stand against bullying thanks for watching this video I hope you got a lot out of it. A lot of these celebrities that we have and pro athletes and business owners really talk about what's going on in their life and and what they've dealt with so if you have any questions or, or you need information, go to mylifemypower.org. We have a bunch of different resources on there. And if there's anything on our site that still isn't answered, you have questions about, feel free to visit our Contact Us page, and we would love to hear from you. And 
We'll talk with you soon. Make it a great day. Thank you.